So good morning, guys. Uh, as you know, Lady Coco has had some uh, damage, and uh, we we thought the season was going to be it was going to be a season-ending injury to Lady Coco, but not with my wife. Look what she got us at this this weekend. <laughs> she got she got us staying in the cabin. And there's the burb. We ain't let the burb go. We were supposed to be letting the burb go, but thankfully we hadn't, because uh, now we can still do trips like this here. So we're in Jersey, uh, we're in Cape May, and we're staying here for a couple of days yet, um, just to continue the season, continue getting out and uh, different experience. This is definitely a different experience. Our first time in a cabin um, is tight. <laughs> the cabin is tight. It's, it's a two-room, no bathroom, no running water, just electricity. And it has AC in there, but we don't need AC. It's a nice breeze. We turned the AC off last night. But it's not bad at all. Oh, look. look Welcome who, to Jersey. Look who that is. <laughs> Media. Right. So just a backstory about Lady Coco. Yeah. Um, did you say anything about the roof? No, I didn't. Go ahead. So if you if you don't watch or follow us on social media, our roof or a part of our ceiling, the membrane, I guess, the yes. first layer yes. has peeled off. Not not the whole thing. Not the whole That's thing. That's a little section. Yes. And we thought we were gonna be able to get it in right away, but um they said the earliest time they can get in is beginning November. Yeah, beginning of November. So So I was like, Well, that's our season there. Right. <laughs> So this is why we're here in a cabin, um, and we'll, this is probably how we're going to finish out our season. Right. In cabins. In cabins. Season, so. In cabins. I, I want to do a yurt. Yeah, we're trying to get a yurt too. I just couldn't find one yeah. yet. So yeah. They're kind of pricey too. They I are know. a little pricey. Anyway, we're here. We are here in Cape May, like I said earlier. I think we're going to get some pancakes. There's a, like a little pancake spot that we like to go to while we're here. Yeah, and it's supposed to be a gorgeous weekend. Yeah. So, you know what? Let's just go. Look it up. Okay? okay. All right, guys. I don't know if you can see that, but Uncle Bill's Pancake House. That is a must when you're here in Jersey. Delish. The best pancakes ever. <laughs> All right, so of course we stopped at Uncle Bill's for breakfast. Anytime we're in Jersey, Cape May, Wildwood, we stopped at Uncle Bill's for breakfast at least one time because those pancakes is awesome. That's why. Those buttermilks? <laughs> On point. All right, so we did a little walking on the beach, which was kind of nice, and then we're here at Cape May um, is it State Park Lighthouse. Um, but we never ventured over to the other side, yeah. where there's trails and like little lookout sightsee parts, you know. Yeah, and closer to the actual water, we right. actually hiked to the top of that lighthouse. I don't know if you can see that in the background. Yep, we went to the top of that. Other well, side. I did. Dupree right. went right back down. Let me okay. blink pan back this way because she's <laughs> obviously doing too much. <laughs> treat to cool down yes. a little icy mm -hmm. and then it's time to head to grab some wine yes. any wine yet mm -hmm. um, and some dinner for tonight and then we do a tour of the cabin oh. this tour will be short just to let you know <laughs> all right guys so as soon as you walk in the door this is our room for the weekend it's literally just the bed, the TV, 
Um, and then also we have the refrigerator with us and the microwave. So we're, we're set. When they said room two, this is room number two, the bunkhouse room, which is great for kids. Um, when they said cabin, they really meant cabin. <laughs> These are really neat though. These bunk beds, I really like the bunk beds. They're yeah. really nice. Um, it's just very, um, what's a good word for it? Rustic. Rustic. Yes, thank you. But yeah. it is nice. It is. It is. It's uh, nice. It it's is cozy. Cozy. Cozy and rustic are the two words I'm going to use together. Right. For this, for this guy. Yeah. Now but it, you know what? It does. It does have like an AC. We do have yeah AC yeah. for those summer days. And the TV. And that's quite. I mean, to be honest, that's all you really need. Right next door is the bathhouse. But you can tell these cabins don't get like rented out a lot no you know lots of uh daddy long leggers yes. kids are counting yeah <laughs> i mean you're camping though right we're camping so so this is when they say camping i mean right. i guess this is your idea of camping yeah yeah mm -hmm. i do i must say i do miss my camper right i miss the camper yeah. but you know what it's an adventure i told the kids to stop complaining because mm -hmm. we are going to Live and, it up this week. Right, enjoy the time that we have, this you know? It, yeah. And and to be honest, this is all you really need, you know? Like Right. You know, the setup time was you know yeah, sure was no setup. No setup time at I mean, all. There was a little setup. We got up here we got here late in the evening. Late yeah, late in late the evening. yesterday. So I just had to set up the beds. Mm -hmm. Everyone went to sleep. And right. then we just got back from the beach and we just set up all our outside stuff to, right now. So I mean mm -hmm. I think it's worth it. It's a different adventure. Yes. It's it a is. good way to look at it. Yeah, yeah. So, so, anyway. Yeah, it's a nice little gonna, hangout spot. Get a drink, some dinner. Right, show them the outside where we're hanging out. Okay, let's, let's see the setup. Honestly, guys, the setup is not bad. I mean, we have a table, we have a fire ring. We brought our own little table to put all our cooking supplies on, so it's not too bad at all. See, we did keep the, uh, the skillet from JJ. <laughs> we still have a skillet, which we have not used at all. No. Because of the outside kitchen in our camper. Right. But it came in handy. handy this weekend. Yeah. Firing. Yeah. And we also have we have the uh, the charcoal grill. Charcoal grill, which we probably won't use. No, I doubt it. Yeah. So. But. So cozy, rustic for sure. Mm -hmm. I don't think we'll ever be doing this again as far as this type of cabin. Right. Um, but it's fun. It's not bad. It's a fun adventure. All right, boom. So what is for dinner anyway? You will uh, be here chefing it up. Just some chicken breast. Okay. With? With What's the some plan? salad. Do a little seafood salad. Okay. You know, something light. Not something light? Crazy. Yeah. We got some uh, rolls too, some little dinner rolls. Yes. You know, definitely looking forward to that. I'm excited. <laughs> satisfying. Yes, <laughs> yeah. Chicken breast, seafood salad, and right. some butter dinner rolls. Yeah. That was good. It was like a nice light suburb uh, meal. Meal, yeah, yeah, dinner. It was really good. And then we just fun. went for a nice little walk. Yes, yeah, around the park. Let's see what this uh, campground is all about. It's huge. It is nice. It's peaceful here. Very quiet. Yeah. I know it's really out of nice. season. So that, that could be part of the reason. Yeah, yeah. But there's a lot of cabins that are rented out as well. A lot of cabins, a lot of weekend warriors here this weekend. Yeah. Oof. The smoke is smoking me out <laughs> this whole time. <laughs> My eyes are probably tearing up. Anyway, guys, but this, this is it for the day. This is it. This is, this is where we're going to be for the night with our yeah. drinks. We're missing our drinks because yeah. we just got back from a walk. But the beauty of it is, is we're still able to get out. Right. You know, that's what Sonya was like. We, we still have to get out and camp. Yeah, like, just because our camper is <laughs> in need of repair, right? Out of commission. We <laughs> thought we was going to be able to get it in faster. Yeah. I thought I was going to be able to call and say, hey, can we get this in right away? And yeah. they was like, eh, no. No. They were like, we need to look at it, look at it yeah. do some research. Right. 
and then we'll give you a date. Right. And the date's not until November. So it's like, well, what the heck? So, Our season is pretty much done. Yeah, so Lady Coco is all tarped up, looking bad right now. Oof, she looks um, rough. But you know what? It's all good, man. Yeah. It truly is all good. Yeah. You don't get any better than this, personally, you yeah. know? Mm -hmm. I truly enjoy this. I enjoy being around the family. I enjoy being around the you know, fire. Yeah. You know? It's definitely a great weekend. Right. Peaceful, low-key, yeah. not much going on. No. So, this is the way all weekend should be. <laughs> to unplug. <laughs> Right, guys good morning from the cabin love shack here in jersey love shack. Love shack. oh my gosh it was actually a pretty good night honey. yeah i thought so i, I think we so. all slept well yeah. um we have no complaints no, no, it was a really no. really a fun time you know you know what's cabin. crazy because yesterday we were out i think this is the reason why we all kind of appreciated the cabin yesterday we were all out in cape may we spent the whole day out there right. and um so exhaustion kicked in hit yeah you know time. and then we had a kids. fire and we stayed up not late no, we went to bed probably like eight thirty, or at least went inside around eight eight thirty. It was early, like was nine o'clock. Let's say the latest nine o'clock at the latest. Right. I guarantee. And we all went to sleep pretty pretty early. We watched pretty like quick. a couple little shows on, on the TV. Right. And one, one bonus, we had TV <laughs> and some cable. <laughs> we had some oh cable. man, it was oh crazy. My gosh. But you know, um, we walked on the beach yesterday. Yeah. And that was fun. Mm -hmm. Had a good time with that. Yeah. Um, it was fun. One of the things we wanted was to get uh, lobster rolls, and we didn't, yeah, you know, the place that we went to was closed. It was closed, yeah. So I don't know if that was off season type of thing, or yeah. if it was just a COVID thing. I don't know. I don't but. know. But we did uh, go to Mr. Bill's, mm. and that was that's one of our favorite places to go to when we're in Cape May. Right. That you know? is a go-to. If you've never been to Uncle Bill's, they have multiple locations throughout Jersey, so yeah. make sure you just Google it when you get here. But yeah. So good. It was so good. Mm -hmm. Those pancakes you can't get you can't get away from. <laughs> uh, okay, so today mm -hmm. um, we're packing up, heading out of here. Right. Um, uh, that's pretty much it. I mean, we yeah. had an experience with cabins. This is our first cabin experience. <laughs> yes, first um, cabin experience. I don't know. I'm not sure if we'll be back at this type of cabin. Right. See, here in Jersey, they have like these little tiny homes. What? Which they, they we call would, them? They call them like cottages, cottages. like rental cottages or yeah. whatever. But. I would prefer to be in one of those. You know, it has like the law. <laughs> in Dupree's word, it's called plush. More it's plush. very, very plush. Okay. This uh, here is roughing it. I'm not sure if I'm a roughing it type of guy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm built I for think, comfort. You know what, guys? I think not, we're truly used to our camper yes. and having like our summer home on wheels. Right. So not having everything right there, the Accessible. bathroom right there, yeah. everything that we need to Outdoor cook. Outdoor kitchen. Yeah. You know? It was definitely an experience for sure. It was. Um, I don't think we'd do it again. No, we lived it already. In this type of cabin. Yeah. <laughs> we lived the experience already. <laughs> it was I don't fun. think we need it again. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, guys, it was uh, so worth they it. They always and say, don't knock it till you try it. Well, we tried it. We tried it. it. Okay. <laughs> And that's it for us. <laughs> oh man, guys! But it was uh, a fun experience, absolutely. and I'm glad we could say that we did it. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I, again, I'm excited that we did it. <clears throat> Sonya is always pushing us to the limits. Yeah. You know, she's like, "Hey, we still have to go camping. We got to keep the season have going. To keep it moving. Yeah. You know, mm -hmm. with Lady Coco being down, it was kind of like you know, not being defeated, but like it was definitely a bummer. To it be was like, a bummer. Hey, really? Yeah. 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 So she she does good with like planning and booking <laughs> stuff all the time. So. He already gave me a heads up, like, listen, I know we're going to try to get one or two more trips in. Let's try to uh, talk this out before let's, you book something like this again. Let's look at pictures. <laughs> let's look at reviews. Oh, no. just was an hour style right. of ca camping. Yeah. So, anyway. Yeah. We got, well, right now we got breakfast on. Yes. Uh, we're going to head into this, um, I was going to say the city. We're going to head into Cape May again mm -hmm. and try to find, like, another spot for lobster rolls. And then we're going to hit the road back home. So This is it for a little... Weekend casita. <laughs> this is it. I'm glad it's, it's kind of over. <laughs> Even though it was a great experience. I think so. This I is definitely so. uh, yeah. a great little cabin. Yeah. I don't think we'll be back to this cabin though. No, this is like cabin in the woods. Next. Cabin in the woods. <laughs> oh my gosh. It was a great time. It was though. a great time. Yeah. yeah. So what yeah. we're going to do now. Yes. So we're packing up, mm -hmm. using the bathroom before we go. Yes. And we're gonna head down to Cape May. All right. See if we can get some lobster rolls, say goodbye to the beach. <laughs> That's it. All right, sounds like a plan. <laughs> Thank you. 
We made it to Cape May for just another hour or two. Quincy's Lobster Rolls was open. Mm -hmm. Thank goodness. So we're going to bust these open and see what they're all about here. And they look smaller than what we got in, yeah. in Maine. It looks good and it smells, it smells even better. What do you think, Tay? Good? good. Yeah. Now, did we get the, did you order mayonnaise or the no, butter? That's the butter rolls. The butters? Classic. Classic roll. All right, I need to try mine. I did have uh, half of mine. It was not my favorite, to be honest. And we did have the butter ones. But you guys really enjoyed that. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> that was good. Yeah. Really good. Mm -hmm. To be honest, we had lobster rolls in Maine last year, and that was amazing. It, it, is, like, it is Maine, though. It is so, Maine. <laughs> that's the difference. Though. Right. So, not my favorite. Um, but maybe next time I know to get maybe the mayonnaise one. Get all this energy out. <laughs> oh, New Jersey. It's so nice having Jersey so close to home. It was nice to come here, unplug for just two days, eat, <laughs> sit by the fire, relax. Guys, can we just get in and relax? Just another thing about road trips. Getting these kids organized and situated and happy for two and a half hours. <laughs> One thing that we love about the Burb, and one reason we haven't sold it yet, which was originally the plan, is because it's so comfortable. And it has everything we need. It has the entertainment center, um, the, which the kids love. Anyway, guys, got the kids situated for the road. I'm about to kick off my shoes. Honey, you ready for this ride home? No. You gotta stop. You gotta, yeah. you gotta relax. You gotta take those shoes off. It's gonna stink up the car. Oh, rude, rude. <laughs> hey. All right, guys. Once again, New Jersey was a success. It was, it was cool. We, yeah. we enjoy Jersey because we're so close by. Right. You know? And not only is it close by, they have the attractions that aren't aren't just for kids. It's mommy and daddy time too. We can hang out right. Right. by the beach and. Yeah, you know. I agree. So, it's it kind of, you know, like Sonia says, North Carolina pulls on our heartstrings. This also pulls on our heartstrings. Right. But it gets cold five to six months out of the year and, <laughs> and that right there don't pull it's more a deal breaker for it's me deal breaker right there. <laughs> that's why the carolinas is kind <laughs> of like our go-to right. if possible in the near future right so that, just being by the shore yeah, exactly. just yeah. uh, just gives you a sense of peace yeah, which i think we all need every now and then yes, exactly i was gonna say we're water people but i'm not sure if we can consider ourselves water people uh, either i know that's a struggle for me yeah because i love the beach i love the peace and the serenity it brings yeah. I am afraid of water. <laughs> yeah. so we, we can swim. Me, at least me and Tay can swim. Yeah. yeah. We have two swimmers and two non-swimmers. So mm -hmm. Dupree's trying to get me into some classes this winter. For real. I don't know. I don't know, guys. We, we Listen, we got to do it as a family. Yeah, because I need a lot of people in the water with me. Because if I go down... Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's time to wrap up this weekend. Mm -hmm. Again, New Jersey. It's been a blast. Thank yes. you so much. Yeah. You guys ready? Yeah. Yep. All right, yep. guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. We'll see you guys next week. Like and subscribe. <laughs>